Yeah. From Madonna, high five to her. Her new album is being released, and Carson has sat, sat down with her recently. That's right. On Monday, we heard from Madonna on the new album and how much she worries about her daughter being away at college. Well, this morning, she opens up more on the balance she's found between Madonna the icon and Madonna the mom. <coughs> In your life, I mean, right. everything, I'm surprised it took you 13 studio records to really master this idea of what is the perfect description of you, mm -hmm. right? Rebel and heart. Because even like your Instagram account has all these rebellious, cool, typical Madonna pictures. And then what's really shocking about it is all the normal pictures like of, my of like Mercy. I have the same, you know, you've got like her swimming in the pool in yeah. slow mo. Like I have that same, yeah. you know, but video. I'm a like, mom too. You're such a normal mom. Mm -hmm. I am. Is that crystallizing now more than earlier? The more kids you have, the more responsibilities you have, the more you have to really be um, aware of time, time management, and juggling lots of balls in the air and thinking, oh my god, this is, how am I going to do this? How am I going to promote my record and show up at my daughter's show? You know what mm -hmm. I mean? It's, it's a tug of war. And the tug to be Madonna the mom is stronger than ever. With daughter Lourdes in college and son Rocco in high school, and two nine-year-olds, James and Mercy, whom she adopted from Malawi. You guys were in Malawi recently, I understand. Mm -hmm. What is it like going over there with them? It's wonderful. I mean, I, I love taking all of my kids there. They walk into hospitals and tell jokes and stories and embrace children who are in some pretty extreme states health-wise. And they're not afraid. And I love that. And I love to see them behaving in a generous way towards human beings, you know, outside of their world. And they always reflect when we come back about how much it makes them think how lucky they are to have what they have, that they take so many things for granted that other people don't have. Like they get, they complain about going to school and the kids in Malawi complain that they don't get to go to school. Mm -hmm. So it's good for them to see that. Rebel Heart, <laughs> I just want to go back to sex for a second because there's, it's a track on the record, and I'm thinking of Lolo. Segue, I'm thinking yeah. of your daughter in college. I have to ask, I mean, as a mom, and you're so involved as a normal mom. You're just as normal as any mom I know, uh -huh. yet you happen to be Madonna. Yeah. So that duality, you're, you're juggling. It's a little bit cray-cray. It's cray-cray. Yeah, it's But it's like the bit, chorus, what, here, oh my the god, OMG, you're so hot, take my hand, climb on top. Yeah, it's Do a, you have to explain these lyrics to Here's you? the weird thing. Every time my kids would visit me in the studio, it would just so happen that I'd be working on a song like Holy Water or Sex, and I'd be like, um, okay, just can, I'll be, stay outside, I'll be right <laughs> out. Um, I think- you don't have a lot of, there's not a lot of that on the Shrekker. No, there isn't. Um, there's there's well, very poignant, it, beautiful at songs. At this point, Rocco doesn't care. It just goes over his head. He's like, right. ugh, mom. Mom's being mom. Um, the other little kids don't really, they don't, they're not tuned into that frequency yet, and Lola's horrified by all of it. She just wants me to be her mom. And if there were any doubts, Lourdes's mom can keep tackling the physical demands of being 56 and one of the world's top earning performers, you need only look at the Brit Awards in February, where she had a scary tumble and barely missed a beat. Do you love being on the road? I mean, I hate love it, because it's just physically draining. It kills me. But I mean, that's life. We well, do all this. I don't. I do all no, this. I don't do that. No, no. That's no partying mean. when I'm on the road. <laughs> that's the hard side, but the rebel side's going out a little bit. I bet. No, I'm not. I'm really boring on the road. I swear. This is this is as fun as it gets. Drink up, my man. <laughs> <laughs> I just want to end with my favorite story about you, was at an after Oscars party that you throw. And I ran into you late and you said, I've got to go. And I said, why, where are you going? And you said, I have jury duty tomorrow. And I said, no, you don't, you're Madonna. And you said like, tell that to the courts. Well, I got out of it. <laughs> I'm gonna cut, <laughs> I'm gonna edit before you say that. I'm no, humanizing I mean, you. I know what I mean, I didn't get out of it. I had to go, they just cut me for being, a, for creating a <laughs> disturbance. They were like, get lost, you're creating a disturbance. You're sabotaging my uh, yeah. humility point. Oh, anyway, sorry. thank you. Thank you. No, thank you. She got out. had to show up for jury duty. But she went. She yeah. left the party she early. She's Madonna. She showed her yeah. face, and they said, "Get out of here. You're yeah. disrupting the place." Second time in the year. Yeah. It seemed like she was hitting on you. She told me. She Stop called you my man. It. I'm her man. <laughs> Madonna's <laughs> new <laughs> album is fantastic. It's out. It's called Rebel Heart. It's out Dedicated today. to Carson. <laughs> That's yeah. right. Exactly. That's right. All right, Carson. Thank you.